Hi there, hi there, good afternoon. Um, I am an artist and producer known as They Call Me Raptor. But to other people, I am David. <laughs> a guy who's uh, grown up in this area his whole life and has definitely been inspired by it. it. Um, living in Tottenham has cultivated me and I'm sure many other people into thinking creatively and definitely differently. Which is why today I'm going to be doing something slightly different. I've created a nine minute composition that reflects a lot of the thoughts and feelings I have about this area, a lot of the passion, and definitely a lot of the passion that reflects other people living around it. The composition itself is split into three main parts, and each of them consists of a main vocal sample each. The third one was a recording I made in a local business, a record shop at that. The first one is a recording I made from a very familiar setting to many, and sometimes a very crazy one, the 149 bus. <laughs> the middle sample, <clears throat> at, I'd say about minute six, is not something I recorded, but some footage I found that definitely represents the passion and character from an, from an individual in this area. I thought very hard about what I should title the piece, but I decided on community, there is no end, because a true community is an organized one. And there is no end to the potential power and organization and development of an organized community. So that being said, please enjoy and listen with an open mind. Thank you. Thank you. 
Well, as far as I'm concerned, the process, process started quite peacefully, right? There was about 150 people outside the police station, and it was out here, there was five patients, all they wanted was a few answers as to what was happening. The police completely ignored them, you know what I mean, just treated them with contempt, and even at that point, they didn't know that. And then, a young 16-year-old approximately went to approach them just to, again, find out roughly what's going on. And they just took some evasive action by pushing her and then drawing their batons. And that's when the people then started to retaliate. Now, I think in all circumstances, having seen that, most people retaliate. Yes? Now, the police seems to have this contempt for people. And I don't think they necessarily needed to have killed the guy. Yeah, yeah they had apprehended him, right? They was in control, right? There was no need for them to kill him. There was absolutely none. Yeah? So basically, they might be surprised that this has happened, yeah? But they still don't seem to have learned their lesson 30 years ago, approximately, what happened to Bull Farm and Topsworth and their places, yeah? And you cannot keep on oppressing people, right? They talk about Tottenham being bad and things. There's nothing wrong with Tottenham, right? We've got a mixture of, right, of people in Tottenham. Everybody in general gets on, yeah? So why are they trying to make it out as if Tottenham, you understand, is, you understand, that sort of hot spot, and, you understand, it is that bad, it is that bad, it is that bad. They call me Raptor and thank you for listening to my composition. Enjoy. <laughs> <laughs> 